So how do you start a Google Hangout? And what's the best way to start a Google Hangout with someone who hasn't done Hangouts before? Hi, this is Ifat, your G Plus go-to gal. And today in Tips and Tricks, let me show you what's the best way to start a Hangout and where everything is. So before you even start, you want to download Chrome and use Chrome for all Hangouts. Why? Because Chrome is a Google product and Google products work best with Google products. After you did that, install the Hangout Chrome extension and this will give you a standalone app for Hangouts. So we have a few ways to start a Hangout. One of them is to click on the green icon and type the name of the person that you want to hang out with or choosing a person from the list uh, of people that you've already hung out with. After you open up this chat box right here on the top you can click on this video call and this will start a hangout. The challenge with starting a hangout like this is that there is no URL that you can share with anyone and so what we're gonna do we're gonna close this one and we're gonna look at a different way to hang out with people. Here's a better way to start a hangout. Bookmark the link below in the description and when you click on it when you go to that link plus.google.com forward slash start, it will start the same exact hangout, uh, a private hangout, not on air, and you can invite people from here. And so if this is their first time using hangouts, you have a link right here that you can email them. And you don't have that link uh, with the other option. Let's say you started a hangout and the person you want to speak with is not available on video. You can still have them on a hangout by phone. Simply click on the invite people and then add a phone, add a telephone. When you click on that, you can enter uh, a phone number or you can enter a person's name. And if they have uh, filled out their entire, all their information in their about page, their phone number is going to show up here and you can call them for free inside the US. All you have to do then is click call and it will dial your phone. When you answer, the phone is going to be right here on the bottom. So when you answer the phone, the phone is going to be showing as a phone on the bottom of your hangout and they can speak to the phone and hear you and interact with you. You will see a phone icon and they will hear all the other participants in the Hangout. When you invite someone to a Hangout, it's gonna show up in their stream as a post like this, saying uh, that you are hanging out and having a button here that allows you to join the Hangout. This is shared privately, like you can see right here. It's only shared with me and my phone number. This Private Hangouts, Hangouts not on air, are only visible to the people that you invited to join you in the Hangout. No one else will see this invitation because you haven't invited them. The last way to start a Hangout is by clicking uh, either the Hangout icon here or on the top of your browser. On the bottom you see Start a Hangout Party. If you click on that, it will open up a hangout party. It will ask you to write what's on your mind before the share button becomes active. You can restrict it for minors to joining your call. And you can see what other hangout parties are happening right now that you are invited to, that people have invited you to. So you can either join those parties or you can start your own. And still this way of starting a hangout will give you a URL on the top that you can share with people via email. That's it. Very easy. Three ways to start a hangout. Bookmark the URL below and get to know your friends face to face. This is Ifat, your G Plus go-to gal. If you like what you saw here, please subscribe and share it with others. And as always, I'll see you in the stream.